Hello everyone, welcome back to another video from Shomus Biology. CSI NET is knocking the door only 5 days to go and in these 5 days, what 3 things that you must do, what 3 things you should not do, this video is all about that. So the very first thing what you should do is that revision, 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 revision and revise whatever thing you've understood, whatever thing you've prepared for the whole 6 months or 1 year or whatever time you've prepared for CSI NET. This is very important time that you pause whatever you've read and just go back there and try to understand, recapitulate what you've learned. Very, very important phase. You know, reading new things will not help because the time is already gone. This time is for revision. Now, tip number two, what you should do is always go for the questions. Look at the questions and try to solve questions from previous year's question papers and try to solve the questions and try to see where exactly you are you are stuck and try to figure it out and based on that in the exam hall you can escape those mistakes and the third important thing very very important thing is stop the noise means in the in the background you know you are into the social media you know you're being connected with all your friends and uh, rest of the other people preparing for the exam there are multiple suggestions coming in from different places so this can make you confused right so some ex person can say th some things why can say a different thing very very important that you keep focusing on your goal any particular target that you have set any particular routine that you have set you have stick to it and now you are want to apply it to your preparation so there is no chance of look into the others perspective fixed get fixed with your own perspective and just focus there so stop over social media activities for this time frame now the three important tips that you should not do in the last four or five days of CSI net preparation. The first thing is that you should not start any new topic. I know many people may ask like there's only seven days to go or uh, 10 days to go. Let's start with a new unit and I can finish it. No, this is a very bad idea, terrible idea because if you start with a new unit, a new unit will consume a lot of your time and during that time your revision will be hampered. So don't do that. The tip number two that you should not do at the last five days of your CSI net preparation or any other exam preparation is uh, the overthinking of that particular exam. You know, if you overthink of the exam, if you think of the bigger goal that exam is going to set for you is going to hamper your preparation. So you may think like CSI net is a big thing. Oh, it's a tough deal. Uh, am I going to get it this time? I'm not. So what you should do is that you need to break that goal into smaller parts. You need to think yourself that in the exam hall, there are three units part A, part B, part C. In these three different parts, you need to score individual, uh, like you have a target. For example, in part A, you have a target of, uh, let's say, 15, 16 marks or 20 marks. In part C, you have a target of, let's say, uh, 90 marks or 100 marks. In part B, you have a target of 50 marks. So whatever target you set, you just decide your smaller targets and start filling and start achieving the smaller target. It will be easy for you to achieve the large target as a whole. Because you imagine that if you can reach your individual small targets, you add them together, you get your bigger target fulfilled. And the three things, the third thing that you should not do for this last five days of preparation is going through all the different books and all the materials without revising or rethinking of what you've learned. So not revi revising is something that you should not do because obviously you should revise. And at this time point, you need to make sure that you have a proper routine to follow okay because many people i know they get a fear of getting into this examination you can see that every single year if 80000 people fill the form only 45 50000 55000 people are going so huge chunk earlier it was only 10 to 15% now it's 25 to 30% of the students who even fill the form with so much money that is 1000 rupees for a general category they don't go for the exam because of exam fear so you need to get rid of the fear and the only way to get rid of the fear is to stop overthinking about the exam nothing is bigger than your life nothing is bigger than uh, your own uh, presence of mind and it's very very important that you have the presence of mind stop fear for the exam and have a blast in the exam so all the very best to all the csn and aspirants who took admission uh, who took help from us from our youtube videos from our coaching for for paid and non-paid services any of the services we wish all of you the best of luck we issue all of you for the best of our knowledge, uh, for a better preparation and for a very good CSI net examination in these upcoming times. So, okay, so I'll see you after the exam. So for that time being, be bare and continue to do a better preparation. Thank you. Bye.